my mom was a, she's, mm, my mother's a character, let's just put it that way. But tell her about the protection for her because she was a baby, so she missed a lot. You thought mama was going to the bar to get drunk. Mama wasn't a drinker. She was going looking for men. She was the DD always to make sure that she took one home with her. I was terrified. I had to go in and check on you all night long because you were little. Do you remember that? Yes. And like, tell me, tell was, me about that. I don't know. It's like so weird. Like, I remember certain. <laughs> like, I remember looking up and like, there's like lights. Mm -hmm. And then I like lay back down. Your flashback of seeing the lights <sighs> was me coming and getting you. I mean, I don't know. I mean, like I said, I don't know. I mean, like, I don't remember that. Like, I just remember, like, laying back down. So mom taught you, hey, the way to fill up your life is to put a man in place. And as soon as one goes, we're going to replace him with the next If not before. One, right? So that's the model, right? That's how we got to connect these dots. Because and I think when Pumpkin and Alana are looking to... at you, they were, one of the things they always said was, why do you always put a man before me, yeah. right? Which I'm sure is the exact same question you used to ask about your own mama. Oh, yeah. Let me ask you this question. Do you ever feel like your mom put you first? Her thing was, I'm not here all the time, so if you want a new radio, or you want this, or you want this, let me buy you. Mm -hmm. So it sounds like mom's always been very transactional. Very. What's all about money? You give me this, and then I'll give you that. Exactly. Does yeah. that pattern sound familiar? It's a birthday. I got gifts. So gifts are supposed to make it all better? She blows $300 on some shoes that you're never going to wear. Yeah place where you learned that was before you even left home, because that's what your mom did. Yeah. Right. As easy it is to look at you and say, oh, you just do that. A lot of this is not your fault. It started years ago with my mother. Many years ago with my mother. Um. Trying to not get into that. And my mother would not, and I tried to sit down with my mother, and she won't because she will never admit that. When I first started working with you guys, I would sit there and I would look at you, and I'd be like, how in the hell can she not get it? Right. And now, after you guys have shared with me everything you shared right. about mom, it makes perfect sense. Right. Because mom was the model, but it wasn't the role model. Right. But it was the only model you knew. And so subconsciously, we start doing these exact same things in our own life. You see the pattern. Yeah. This weekend is about cycles and breaking the cycles. Right. And yes. a big part of stopping the future cycle yes. is going back and realizing the effect that stuff had on you. Right. right?